Alright, hello everyone, my name is Bultramax, and as you might notice, my face is not here today. And that is because today we're gonna try something completely different, and it is- Whoa, what the hell is happening? I'm flying. Where are we going? Okay, we're here. Yeah, I've downloaded this Minecraft map, which is uh, just about a week old. It's called Wayward Wonders. I started playing it yesterday, and it was actually really, really amazing. It was really fun to play. I played like three hours straight, maybe four. Until I died, and then I cried a little. But yeah, um, I want to try this out for the channel. If you don't like it, then just leave it down in the comments. I want to try it out anyway. Um, because my, my Minecraft is actually quite amusing sometimes for me. Unless I play it for too long, you know. If I play it for like a couple of weeks or months straight, it just gets boring to me. But anyway, without further ado, Wayward Wonders it is. Let's go. And yeah, my skin is Daryl Dixon from The Walking Dead. Because, I don't know, he's awesome. That's why... Hi man, and I'm using a different texture pack, as you might have noticed. Noticed, Hey friend, how you doing? How is it actually called? I don't know. If I, uh, if you want to know what the texture pack is called, just ask me in the comments. I will leave it in the description as well. Because I think this one looks really cool. It looks kind of medieval, you know? And I like the medieval ages. So yeah, there we go. Read this first before we start. I hate reading. But there we go. Before you start, make sure you can see the zombie in the cage. If you can't, you have to re-download the map and turn off peaceful mode before loading. Blah blah blah. Notice the big endstone wall. This is what the world border looks like. The map is open world, but I have provided a wall to turn you back if you've gone too far. The sky will also turn black when you're getting close to the wall. Stand on the obsidian to see what that looks like. Basically, if you travel by ocean for a while, you probably need to turn back. 3. Hit the start button when you are ready to begin your CTM, which stands for... Um, create the monument, if I'm not mistaken, survival adventure. So yeah, the thing in this um, particular mod is there are like these big uh, monuments scattered in the world. Let me just get rid of this book. Like these big monuments and they uh, need to be completed somehow. You need to um, gain... was it wool? I think it was wool blocks. Don't really know for sure. But yeah, um, let's stand on the obsidian for a second to see what it looks like. There we go. If we go too far, this is what this guy... Oh, hello. You look quite nice. But anyway, if you want to know what the mod is about, I will leave a link to the page in the description down below as well. But without further ado, let's head into the world. Hello, sand. Oh, what's that? It's a chest. Beautiful. Let's see what's in the chest. So yeah, I already played like the first... What was it? Four hours of this game. Um, I collected one piece of wool or stone. And there's like, I don't know, like 20 or something? Quite a lot, so yeah, I didn't play that much. But anyway, Wayward Wonders by Marty. Shit. I mean, come on, there we go. <sighs> Evil forces have taken over the finest locations ever to exist on the face of the earth. It is up to you to find them and rid them of this evil. You are the only pity left in the world. Pity, I'm sorry. Many have tried and many may still be doing so. The evil remains. The 12 wayward... Okay, so it's 12 and not 20, actually. The 12 wayward wonders lie waiting. Find them and save them. Only then will you prove that you can represent all that is good and face the root of all evil. The mausoleum of Halicarnassus is not nearby. Wow, that actually ran pretty well. It will serve as the monument to which you must bring back the blocks of the wonders, but it does need liberation of its own. Wool blocks are also scattered around the world. They are optional on your adventure, but bringing them back will reap random and unique rewards. You may wander the world, or you may receive guidance by paying for the coordinate books. The salesman is nearby. There are 28 possible blocks to recover, wow. But far more secrets, items and locations to find. Using ender chests, selling your spawn and finding spirit stones that give temporary buffs will all be useful on your journey. Recovering the 12 adventure blocks, which are clearly marked, will unlock a secret final location. Good luck, enjoy. I sure will, thank you for that, um, Mondi. Oh wait, it's a zero. M zero Andy. There we go. Okay, so what's over here? Uh, fast travel. Now nah, we're gonna go on foot, I guess. Or can we go to the Mesosoli Coli Colium of Harley Nassus? That's where we want to go first. Because that's where uh, the first enemy will be. But anyway, wait a second. Does that mountain look like a camel to you? Just over there, you know? I don't know. Kind of looks like a camel to me. <laughs> But anyway, I want to um, make these episodes around... Oh wait, there's actually a box here, isn't there? But I want to make these episodes around 20-25 minutes maybe each. 
But there will be a lot of uh, heavy editing involved, I guess. So yeah, maybe I'll play for an hour or so. Sometimes I need to keep an eye on the time. We're already going for six minutes. Let's go. Okay, there's a chest over here. Great, brilliant. What is in it? Oh yes, of course. It's not even randomized. Ah, gosh darn it. This is exactly the same thing as they gave me in the first try. So I think this world is just generated as it is. It doesn't give you like this random world where, which will just generate everything for you in a random location. No, it's actually a save file that you had to download. You found a wonder, the mausoleum at Harley Carnassus. That is a really tough name for a Dutch guy like me. Hey horsies! If only I had a saddle already. Um, let's just chop down this tree over here. I'm gonna need a sword to kill some animals. So yeah, there's gonna be some uh, collecting involved in this game, but I think I'll just do that off screen for you guys. So you will be just in right into the action of this game. You know, to keep it fast and speed and entertaining for you guys. But anyway, I'm glad to uh, at least try this. So yeah, let's see how we fare in this world, because to be honest, I kind of suck at Minecraft. There we go, oh good planks. Hey, wait a second. No, this is the exact same. There we go. Give me that. I want this over here. Thank you. Is that all? I might need, need a pickaxe as well. What am I doing? I don't know. There we go. And give me this. Okay. Now let's get some food. Where are them, where are them chickens? I saw one over here. Chicken, there you are. Come back here. Can I please lend your uh, chicken breast, please, for a second? There we go. How about we take you out as well? Easy peasy, okay. That's a bit of food. What What are you doing over there? That's not safe, you know. I know you're a horse and so you can jump really high, but still. I guess this is also going to be a bit of a challenge of me. For me, I mean. Because normally I just play horror games and horror games and more horror games. So yeah, I've kind of been used to commentating on horror games, you know. Ooh, I need to take this down. This is bad. So yeah, I've been kind of used to commentating on horror games. But um, a game like Minecraft is something totally different. So yeah, hopefully I, I do good for you guys. Good enough for you to not unsubscribe. Because please don't do that. This is just my OCD, but I always only want to chop down oak trees. I'm sorry, I know this is dark oak, but it's just my OCD talking over here. Don't worry guys, you'll get used to it. Okay, let's at least get to the... Uh, I'm just gonna, gonna, gonna call it the M. Because I don't know the word. It's too difficult, okay? The mas Maselo Zolicum of Horaris Toteles. I have no idea. Um, let's go down, let's go to it. So yeah, I actually did pretty well when I was testing this thing out. I found like this huge cave system underneath the Mausazolicum thing. Which is probably still there since this is just a save file. It's basically gonna be all the same. Everyone's playthrough is gonna be the same because it's not randomized, I guess. It's just up to you what you wanna do with it. But anyway, I already found like um, 40 diamonds and 40 emeralds in just 4 hours of gameplay. I mean, wow. Normally that takes me up to a couple of days. Before I find that match. But this game is just about getting equipment and slaying all the evil monsters, I guess. Oh, I need that chicken. Let's creep up on him. Chicken. Oh, he's ours. Don't even worry, my friend. Just keep walk. Yes, exactly. Just keep walking. Just keep walk. No. Just keep walking. Nothing to be worried about, okay? There we go. Nice and easy. Oh, another one. Another helpless victim. Hi, man. Don't even worry. Don't, don't, just stay, stay like this. Yes, yes, brilliant. There we go. Taken out in silence. But anyway, let's go in here and let's get our first quest, shall we? Let me find out in a second. Uh, first quest, yes. And side quest. We also want one of those. Let's check the other chest over here and let's get rolling. Rules and info. Blech. I know it's boring, but you need to know about rules and info, guys. It's just part of the game. So anyway, let me get rid of these things over here. T -t -t -t. There we go. First quest. Ixion is waiting for you under the mausoleum. He is your first foe, but do not take him lightly. This actually went wrong when I tried this yesterday, because I was going underground. 
Um, then Ixi Ixion, right? Ixion said, ooh, I've been waiting for you, my friend. You cannot defeat me. And just like a second after that, it said, oh no, I am defeated. And then Ixion didn't show up for me. So I hope this won't happen this time again. That would be a bummer. I actually, actually, wanna, actually wanna see, wow. I actually wanna see what the first enemy is about and how strong he is. Side quests. There are a lot of side quests. We'll just take care of them uh, on a later state. Let's just throw it. Ah, let's put it back. Let's be a gentle guy. There we go. Oops, sorry. Didn't mean to do that. Can you please go back in? Apparently, you. I, he doesn't want me. I don't know what's going. Okay, then don't take it. Whatever you, whatever your fancy is, man. Mausoleum of Halicarnassus, you found the monuments, welcome. This is where you will bring back the adventure blocks and brew blocks to replace them on the, their... Okay. The adventure monument is the one at the end of the red carpet. Completing it will spawn a reward chest and also allow you to access the end game. The wool monument is split up on the sides, eight blocks on each. The white wool is placed to show you the correct placement. Only very specific blocks can be placed onto the pedestals. They will be found in chests on top of lapis lazuli and will be clearly marked. Do not use blocks that are unlabeled. Doing so will, no doubt, make me very angry. Sorry, Mondi. Make sure you place all blocks correctly, using the white wool as a model. To be clear, all blocks should be placed on the upside down quartz stair. If not, the redstone will not be triggered and we all be feel, will all be very sad. Once all the adventure blocks are placed, you will receive further guidance. Each wool block placed provides a random bonus reward. Placing all of them does nothing except prove you are quite the adventurer. Important notes, do not destroy blocks in the mausoleum. That is actually what I did in previous episodes. I broke down one of these glass floor thingies. So yeah, do not craft any blocks for use on the monuments. Do not use adventure or wool blocks for resources. Pardon me, do not make nether portals. Complete as much or as little of the adventure as you want. Cheating is frowned upon in many social circles. Be cool. Go to the forum if you need help, have feedback, blah, blah, blah. Suggestions, take one block at a time from chests or store them in your ender chest. Minimap waypoint mods could be very useful. I do not have that one, but maybe I'll need it in the future. Who knows? Use the fast travel and spawn setting stations or use bats frequently. Jeeves sell... Ah, the guy. Yeah, that's the guy. Jeeves. Yeah, he's my friend. If boss battles are too difficult for you, try to find wolves or explore more to improve your gear. Yeah, I made that mistake yesterday. By cord and you... Buy coordinate books if you are lost or struggling. Don't be a lazy dwarf. And have fun. Throw it around. Jeeves, you want to pick that up, please? I can not get it back in a chest, so maybe you want to do it for me. Because I'm, I'm a moron, apparently. But let's see what he has to trade right now. We have nothing, but yeah, still. Skeleton, wow. Ten skeleton skulls for one emerald? You are really expensive, my friend. Wither skeleton skull. Okay. We've got nothing right now. Ender boots. Oh, I want those. But anyway, it's still day, so um, let us get underground. Let us get some armor. Sorry. So sorry. Ooh, is that your friend? Ooh. Hopefully he didn't see me. Oh, no, oh, he looked at me. Oh, I'm I'm boned. I'm boned. What is he? He's gonna bite me, isn't he? I'm sorry. Sorry for murdering your friend. I'm just gonna, you know... Let's shake on it, okay? Let's let's just shake on it. Let, let, come on, come on, let's shake on it. There we go. Friends again. Brilliant. Oh, hello there. Oh, thank you. A book and a raw fish. That is really nice of you. Let me kill this cow. Just to celebrate. Okay, is this the hole that I was talking about? Uh, oh it is. But I need torches. Oh no. I'm gonna die soon, am I not? Please, give me, give me, give me the stone quick. Just hit it with leather. Who cares? I need some stone ASAP. I'm taking way too much time talking to you guys, and now I'm scared. Hopefully I don't die in the first episode. That would really be a bummer. I would be so ashamed. It would look like I'm a total Minecraft noob. Oh, please fall down. Come on, you can do it. Oh, wait, let me help you with that. There we go. Thanks. 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 Eh, don't. Ooh, this is... I hear you. Oh, there is he. Hey, man. Is that... I, oh, okay, he's there. He's coming. No. Come on, please. I don't even have anything in defense, man. Think about what you're doing right now. I have a sword. You have nothing. Okay. Okay, stay there. No. 
Stay dead. It's not good. Not good for your health. That's what I meant. I tried to warn you, man. Okay, I need to get something cooking right away. I'm already getting hungry. This is not this is not the best start ever. I apologize. There we go. How many good do I got? 18. I'll just get a couple more. Until we get to some coal. I cannot see anything. Can you guys see anything? Do you see any coal? I see iron over here, but coal never to be seen. Nowhere. So yeah, um hopefully a lot of you guys will like this. Maybe you won't, but um that's just the way it will be. I have plenty of other horror games for you guys if you don't like Minecraft. I have like 400 videos already, all horror related. So if you don't like Minecraft, you can always still check those series. Because I'm keep, gonna keep them going, of course. I think these videos will only be up like, I think, two, maybe three times a week. Not too much. I'm trying to focus on horror because that's really my thing, you know. But yeah, I want... <laughs> you guys wanted more diversity, okay? So I'm trying to give you more diversity. And if you don't like this diversity, then... Well, I don't care. And still no call. I'm being punished for nothing. Okay, let's get some better tools running. And it just started raining. Wow. Wow, oh, thundered even. Man, God must really love me today. Okay, let's get some... Ooh, how did I miss you? How did I miss you, my friend? Okay, get some light. Just quick. I need more sticks. There we go. Yes. Okay, finally. There we go. Scatter them all around. Oh, stop it, Thunder. You're scaring me. One over there. There we go. And one over here. Beautiful. Now let's get this iron cooking. So yeah, I will just collect everything I will find in here. And then I'll get back to you, so be right back. No, oh, okay. No, stay stay back. Dude, I have, I have nothing. Please, don't. Okay, th this is all your fault, okay? I was not responsible for your death. Not even in the slightest, okay? This was all your fault. You came to me. This was self-defense, okay? Any witnesses? Good. You know, usually I just swear a lot. But that's because horror games scare me. And when I get scared, I just swear a lot. But in this game, there will be hardly any swearing. I promise you. I will probably still... Swear sometimes if I get killed or something like that. But yeah, apart from that, no swearing. Because this is going to be kid friendly. Yes, kid friendly. You heard me. What are you looking at? What are you looking at right now? Why is everything exploding at random? I have no idea. Let's start with making some tools, guys. We're gonna need those in here. Let's start with a sword. There we go. That's one. Ooh, nice. See, that's what I like about these texture packs, you know? They just make it look better, in my opinion. Let's make a pickaxe. There we go, get rid of the old one. An axe, maybe, you never know. Okay, let's just make a shovel as well. Maybe we need to dig through some gravel. Could be handy. 21 left, let's start with a chest plate then. There we go, that's one. Leggings and a helmet. Brilliant. Look at this. Already getting along pretty quickly. Only need the boots. And then we're good to go. Deeper and deeper in this building. It's not even a building. What am I talking about? I tried to said, say the B word. But then I changed my mind. And I changed it to building. So that turned out pretty weird. Okay, there we go. Iron booties. Okay, there we go. We're all set. Um, I guess I'm gonna come back here. Am I not? Yeah, I am. So, let's make a chest, just in case. Let's store some goodies over here. We're gonna keep this as a base. Don't really need to fish. This, um, this might be handy for a new pickaxe, you know. Let's get rid of those. Those. Raw beef. Why are you not cooked, raw beef? I have no idea. I don't really need you, I think. Hopefully. Don't need the feathers down here. Don't need the book as well. Okay, we're cool. We're cool. We're good to go. Alrighty, just give me a bit more, just one more, so I can make new tools and such. Because we're gonna need a lot of pickaxes down here. Just wait and see, guys. Okay, I think that is actually going to be all for this episode. In the next episode, we're gonna go down. 
hopefully find a lot of diamonds so we could craft up this diamond armor really, really quickly. And yeah, then we're gonna take on the world. So hopefully you enjoyed this part one. If you did, leave a like and leave a comment about what you think about this... Um, how do you call it again? This series. Because yeah, I think it's gonna be awesome. Have fun. Okay, I'm done rambling now. Goodbye. I will not touch you. Why do I touch it again then? I have no idea. Let me get those coins. There we go. Go. Come on, controls. Work with me. Jump. There we go. And a short jump. Do it. And now we go down here.